So it's time for Conezilla Phase 2 or Heat 2. Um, Stephen Allen was our round one winner, uh, but he's not here today, so I've stolen his crown. Uh, so Stephen was uh, six cones in 17.42 seconds. That's what we've got to beat. So six cones, 17.42 seconds. <laughs> Can it be beaten? I think potentially because. We've got Ross Ogilvy as one of our drivers today for Coenzilla. Uh, he has got a Lexus 1UZ powered E36. This has actually got the radiator in the boot or the back somewhere and it's got some ducting. The leap, I don't even know where the ducting is, it's that good. Maybe it's near Jake's bum. Yeah. Who knows? A duct in there for sure. That looks neat. I don't even see it. It's cool. Um, so, V8 powered E36 coupe, SDC car. And he today is going to go up against Lewis Dixon in an E36 pickup with loads of lights that he's not showing us just yet. Lewis has already tapped the wall today, so he's sporting a bit of damage. Lovely. But that quarter is getting it today. Confident? No. Why not? Because it's wet. Yeah, but you've got Lewis and the big E36 touring pickup thing, which he's happy to smash into everything. Yeah, you. You. <laughs> Plus, you've got the nice quarters. Just no. Lewis has not got nice quarters. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be fun. Be fun. Uh, six cones and 17.42 seconds is the record set by Stephen Allen uh, for you to be take this lovely, no expense spent crown from my good self. Try. Good try. We'll good try. man. Good man. Go deep if you have to. Deep. It's just Jeep's grass. <laughs> It's bloody time! It's going to happen! It's time for cones, it's time for quarters, it's time for touring to hit coupes! Is it time? It's time for cones! Yes! yes! Look at the man mountain, that is Marco! <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> He's nearly rage quit! It's okay Marco! You get that back again! Loving this, eh? Yeah, a wee bit, wee bit, <laughs> wee bit. Nice big oil slick, car save Mark Gemmel. Gonna make things tricky around the third and fourth cones. So Ross Ogilvy going for his first practice run. He's gotta beat six cones, 17.42 seconds for the judge run. We're gonna get up in the middle. Kenny, do you realise this is going to, us standing here is going to have a terrible impact on your getting the cones, i.e. you're doing them all? Yeah, good. <laughs> right, we don't need to time this bit, do we? This is just a practice just run. Just a practice Does run. Does that? <laughs> Let's not tell him. Right. Let's not tell him. Go, 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 go! Here he comes. Straight. A good run apart from he got two with his front bumper. <laughs> it doesn't really count. Not what you meant. Nah. Yeah. So that's only really like three. Anyway. Yeah. Good practice though. Good practice. Good run. practice. Right. Let's get the cones back. Cool. Anyway. Right. Right. You ready, right. Kenny? Put your thumb up as your ankle. We'll both do it. Big vety noises. Go. One. One. Two. Two. Goodness. That was a pretty good run. Yeah. Again. That's the last of his practice runs anyway. though. It's time for the real deal. Let me get out the uh, official Seconda sponsored timing device. Right. Which is... Uh, da -da 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 -da. Too many pockets. iPhone! iPhone. Here we are. Right, let's get the cones back. Da -da -da. 
Gonna hand the uh, clock over to use my official timekeeper. Oh, I'm not sure how you're gonna you, <laughs> how you're gonna deal with using such yeah. an a, such a pleasantly <laughs> you know. sympathetic yeah. device. Look at oh look at the user interface. Really it makes way too much sense. Uh, <laughs> oh, well, wait, I want, you want to time something? Nah, you'll need to get something else. There's an add-on for you that. You need to get a phone that works for that. <laughs> oh, that's planned in the iPhone 14. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's give him a big thumbs up. Stop. How many cones? 30 seconds and ooh, about, what was that, about don't even know. three cones three, maybe? One, one, two, three. Three cones, yeah, three, three cones. cones. He's up there, nice, nah, you're knackered mate, that was you. That's you, come in, come in. He's trying to get another go. Let's go chat to him. Yeah. Hands up if you thought Ross all the way was rubbish! <laughs> there we go, a big show of hands. Three cones, 30 something seconds. Disappointed in myself. Yeah. Well, your first drop was better. Second drop was good, was it not? Yeah, I think the first was better. Second one was the zero because you had a big spinzy. Yeah. <laughs> big spinzy. Uh, the first so, one was much better. You got like six, but then. Yeah. So the one Do you know what it is? I reckon it's the pressure yeah, at this level. Pressure, it's that's the it. pressure. Uh, stay there because we're going to take all your uh, cameras off you. Thanks, Ross. That's not our one. This is what you have to deal with at Driftland. This is the secure tow strap fitting. Look at that. He's cable tied his proper Driftland tow strap in. I wonder why it came off. Why could that have come off, Kenny? No idea. Oh, cool, cool. Cable ties intact in everything. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking audio recorder, card's full. What have you been recording? Man, I forgot to check if it was empty or not. <laughs> See, at all levels, from basic people vlogging all the way up to our good selves, <laughs> well, we're not basic people <laughs> vlogging. Yeah, that was that was kind of my point. Never mind. Just make it sure. Right, people right. Think serious. So Ross Ogilvy was disappointing at best. Rubbish. Rubbish. The next contender. Right, I heard that. Oh, do you know why you heard it? Because I fucking said it out loud. <laughs> Here he comes. It's Lewis Dixon with Drew Abbey's absolutely dreadful E36 Touring. Could be on five cylinders, could be on six. He's got the lights on, he means business. He's been watching Ross straight down to the start line. Straight down, off the... Majestic. Have you got the Rolex approved timing device? Yeah, we don't need it quite yet though. Yeah, just wanted to check. See ya. Lewis has taken the run up of absolute doom over there. There he goes. Yeah, could have a massive crash here. It's fast. One. None. Oh! A zero! That was straight from the book of Lee Smart Racing. Delighted, over the moon, incredible, brilliant. <laughs> Was that a proud father moment? Rubbish! <laughs> Rubbish! Oh dear, dear, oh dear, right. The place is an, like an oil slick, to be fair. Yeah, it's very slidey here. I feel like we're in the danger zone here. Yeah, that's fine. It's only us. I live my life in the danger zone. Sorry. <laughs> This right, is maybe ready. a good way to invoke business interruption if you, <laughs> <laughs> you get yourself mortally wounded. Get it. Let's go. go! So this is Lewis's second and final practice run. The next run he's going to do, which will be timed by a Rolex approved timing oh. device. Yeah, I think he's obviously realised. One. One. Oh, he's got the lead oh. he's, a, he's a clean sweep so far. Oh, oh, oh. 
<laughs> oh, and the last one. Oh. oh, no, I'm not sure about that. That was uh, two, wasn't so it? So he went fast, that didn't work. Yeah. And he's went slow, and also that also didn't work. didn't work. So now he needs to try really fast, would be my option. Yeah. Oh, just better. Better? Better. Right, get the timing device out. Oh, yeah, I need to put this phone back. Oh, crikey. Is this got your stupid fingerprint on? Yeah, it will do. It needs the bad touch to activate. Who is going to look at your phone? That's a good question, a good point. Like, <laughs> why is this locked? Yeah. No, you... yeah. There's nothing interesting on this. Yeah, thing. because like, at most, if you get it, get my phone and... Just you get messages you, you me. just get hassle from you, you'll probably end up giving a briefing of a silver experience or something <laughs> like that. Geez that. Yeah. yeah. I'm ready. Lewis is ready. Here he goes. This is, this is where it all counts. Jixi might have even started the timer. Yeah, good, good, good. One. 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 Big switch. Yes! Really? Oh, that's, is that even drifting? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that was lovely. Oh, four. He's going with the line. That's going with the line. What's his time? 28 seconds. So he's beating Ross. He's beating Ross. By one cone in two seconds. But, but we do not he is, have. He's way short of being uh, king of the cone today and Conezilla champion. Uh, retaining champion, Stephen Allen, if you could have been here, uh, you would get to put this upon your lovely bonds. Uh, unfortunately, it's on mine again. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this drip on Ren's beak. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Right, let's go see. Yeah, let's go and have a little chat. Let's go speak to the second loser. Yeah, second loser, pair of wanks. Yeah, Conzilla World Championships getting really popular today. Um, as you can see, big, big crowd around. of spectators have come for the Conzilla Mexican World Championships. Wave. Big Mexican wave? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> hey, nah. that's the best one we've yeah, ever thank had. Thank you, two people. I actually beat the STC. Lewis, do you want the good news or the bad news? Is this good news? There is good news. You beat Ross Ogilvy. Quite good. Bad news is you have not beaten Stephen Allen and taken Conezilla Championships. You've got three or four cones. Four and twenty-eight was it? Twenty-eight seconds. So yeah, four cones, twenty-eight seconds. Kicking the arse out of Ross Ogilvy, but way off Stephen Allen. Would you like to come back at some point for another Conezilla World Championship attempt? Yes, definitely. Excellent. Glad to see you there. Maybe you can join us in South Africa one day. <laughs> Uh, well, are you paying for the trip? <laughs> I don't know, I'll just try and get some <laughs> sucker in South Africa to do it for me. <laughs> right, <laughs> that's the end of the episode. Let's get rid of this stuff, let's get the cameras off, and let's talk about STC. Bye! Bye.